Hello everyone and welcome back to Metroid Prime. I'm Amari Giacomo and he's here to help me out as usual. Play. Play. Right, you're over there. What are the pins? Do you what do you want? Do you want spider ball or do you want X-ray visor? Not X-ray thermal visor. Hmm. I'm not sure. You have chosen thermal visor. Oh, don't worry. That won't be the only one. <laughs> Get out of my face, please. They didn't even wait for the cutscene to end. I don't want to take that one. This one? Yes. Oh, I see. Are these quite this one? Yes. I like how it keeps whatever beam you're using in, in the low set. In the yeah. Ooh. That is quite a bit to explore. Yep. Not quite a starship seems. That's, more about map. That screams boss arena. That it does. You're gonna wanna head over there to that dome on the left. We're right. The one going up there? Yeah. I do need to go through the control settings later and please it's not a bit.
You are destructive, you know that? There's a few lore in this area. I don't want to make sure to grab that missile pickup before it just spawns. You walk right past it. Okay, you can go like this. Or you can fight the pirates that are still in the room. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. You don't believe me, do you? Don't forget that. Don't forget that uh, charging the wave beam will electrocute enemies. things you scanned up on that upper platform actually had a red text. It's lore. But no, no, like one of the minor ones you scan popped up red text, but you close it so fast you can't read it. I do wonder why you scan those when you never read them. <laughs> Lab Aether, huh? But what is Lab that mean? Uh, no, right. Hi there. Hi there.
No. Don't forget to grab the pickup. Very important. Yeah, you may need him later. May a scene. Definitely and later a scene in just a moment. <laughs> Perhaps. Gee, I wonder why I need to do that. It's not active, you can't do anything with it. It's probably gonna be part of a boss fight. Gotta have a little more faith. So it would seem. Alright. Nope. Wrong one. Hey, you realize that there's more things than just bomb slots, right? Got that one. How do we get the feeling that this thing's going to attack me as soon as I finish this? Because you're paranoid. Why not have good reason for me by now? But it's not a boss, it's Scan that, by the way. Hey, why would I actually read that one? Like, read the. Please. Yeah. We know that planet, don't we? Yeah, you could say. Multicore making the universe of the running construction a ship. That's where we are. Extraterrestrial object, you say? <laughs> okay then. That is kind of scary. Oh. 
hostile planet much. That's a war for it. So, right. uh, in the entire system, this was literally the only even remotely decent planet, huh? Yep. I mean, Zeebs is hospitable. Sort of. Something like that. Stamish is able to live there. Uh, by jumping across to the next platform. Only one way to find out. Fair enough. Oh, that's. I thought it was closer to the wall. Mm -hmm. Basically, char uh, charge the power, the uh, power beam, and then fire a missile. Let's see. Now we can go the other way. I should probably go backwards first. Oh, just a size spot. Pretty good. Miss. 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 <laughs> I guess you have the wave beam selected. Oh. Uh, so it needs to be the normal power beam. That's, that's what I said, the power beam. Keep forgetting they're not one and the same. Yes, there are other super missile combos for the other beams. Oh, nice. Yes, indeed. Elevate. That was completely unnecessary. Yes. You know me so well. Oh boy, is this again? Eyes up. Eyes up. So what, uh, the way isn't bad against them, because it has some traction with those. That works too. Just keep in mind, you're eating five missiles every time you do that. That adds up after a while. I mean, they clearly designed the Starina to test out your new toy. 
Mm, if you say so. I mean, you did really get that right now. Power me, son. That is not necessarily mean it's explicitly made to test it out. Have you played enough games? No. I'm just well aware that sometimes it they'll throw you curveballs like that. Long way. Well you can't. Because uh, Sky Pirates will dodge. Hey, you might need to activate it. Or maybe I'm... Yeah. Research Lab Aether. Going back down. Stasis tank. Uh, I'll go and tell you, scanning it will start the fight. The Metroid. There's no person yet. I hope you're just scanning those for no reason. You're not even reading them. Inevitable, inevitable oh great, a Metroid. Another one. <laughs> like I said, scanning is what starts to fight. Usually one super missile is about all it takes. Alright! Now we used to now we now we ready to put those on whenever they're gonna start showing up. I said, uh, now be ready to take those on whenever they show up, because they're going to be showing up now. I don't think shooting the floor is going to help. Uh, I was extracting you, though. Alright, there's some loot in this room, just so you know. It's the uh, beam in this game. That's not a thing whatsoever. <laughs> Hmm. 
Silly pirates. Recording to logbook. No little bit. So what am I first instinct was my side? <laughs> Alright, there's still one more item in the room. It's not that way. It's not on this floor. It's showing you where the next uh, item is. What, what the next main item. Go ahead and open your map. Gee, it's almost like I was already going that way. Yeah, it does that. Anyway. You know, scan visor does not necessarily help with this. That one off of us. Yeah, now you're fighting Metroids. Oh, it's not really That's really also, I'm also I'm 99% sure that the Metroid that was on the ground floor in here could have been ignored. Yes, but it was a Metroid. I was trying this face. Recording to the lock. You can also ignore them. There are several Metroids in the room. Don't worry, you'll get to them in a minute. I need to test, you
this is the room that I determined that, uh, that, uh, Metroids are, in fact, vulnerable to a, a super missile to the face. <laughs> That's gotta be bright. Yeah, hopefully it Imagine flash. Fine. Imagine flash bringing yourself to get an upgrade. Shadow Pirates. They can cloak. Anyway. Anyway, I'd go ahead and charge a super missile. As you climb up the stairs. For the inevitable containment breach. Denied. <laughs> like, like I said, Metroids are vulnerable to a super missile to the face. To discover what the Metroids are weak against, it was point, point blank, blank annihilation. annihilation. Yeah. Was there another one? Yeah. I should probably switch my visors. It's... it's still dark. Like, the entire area has gone dark. Now what is that? Nope. 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 Wouldn't it be nice if you could see what you're shooting at? That's a security drone. Still dark. I told you it stays dark. You basically have cut the power. Careful, don't let the next door out until you're ready for it. First, keep the Metroid alone and move on with your life. Okay. 
I'm finding a like, of time. For now. Yeah, it was uh I don't really like the thing. That's thermal visors. Yeah. They are not fun. No long, I just ignore these guys. Hey Ran. It's dark. So it is. Ignores. Uh, you can du du you can ditch the thermal now. I think. Oh, uh, maybe not. Maybe I, okay, I lied. Research lab Hydra. So somewhere in the corner of the room close to you is a missile. Try ditching the thermal vision if you need to. The advisor may actually be helpful. Since this is one that you can't pick up without super missiles. Hmm. So it's down here in this room, in this corner, right? Well, it has to be in the room, and it's in on this side of the room. Maybe it's upstairs. Maybe. I think I fucking remember. Afraid to switch between visors as you need to. I'm not sure which option is the least useful in this case. <laughs> no kidding. I wouldn't wait. 
Yeah, I wouldn't waste missiles on the Metroid right now. I saw something going down and I thought it was its action thing. Uh, based on the map, it is on the side of the room with that door in the uh, in that corner. Like, like, the direction you're facing, it's in the right corner. But it doesn't say where specifically. Only that, it, only that it needs the super missile. So. It doesn't say which level it's on, does it? Nope. Sounds about... Okay. Yeah. See them? Yeah. That one off the list. Definitely get the thermals. What's that? Uh. I didn't. I, I, I don't need thermals in this game, but okay. Those guys were cool. And. Still kill them. Then again, I grew up fighting fighting elites in Halo who the cloak, so Yeah. Just because I can't Just because I can't see this I mean I can't kill you. Don't forget to save. Name it. Yeah, maybe I will. Thank. Hey. Talita does not replenish my missiles. Yes, yeah, truly unfortunate for you. <laughs> and for the pirates. Arg. Also, you cause it means it will be more painful for them. This door has no power. I see. Do I need to do the puzzle all over again? No. Nope. You can solve it from right in front of the, uh... Oh. I need a power missile, don't I? Yep. This missiles, thank you. Well, now! Missiles, thank you. Like, now! Um... Let me point something out for you that'll help you out. Look at the door again. See, 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 see the little that little light there? Mm -hmm. That mean that means you have to do one of the little uh, power nodes. Switch, switch to your thermals. Oh. 
Yeah, there'll be one of those for every one of the uh, nodes you need to hit. I don't know. Yeah, I, something I noticed in a different area. So if there's multiple of those little lights, there'll be multiple things for you to hit. Don't well, have the game saying you might need these. Yeah. I clearly don't have enough. No. No, you do not. But suffer. I like how it turns I like how it turns red when you point at the dormant boss. Well, yeah, it's a boss. How do I know what that boss looks like? Yeah. A big pile of rocks. In the middle of a giant I don't know. A big pile of angry rocks. Very angry rocks. I'm not gonna exactly tell you what to do here. You're gonna have to figure it out. Just remember that uh, your logbook is your friend. Yes, I'm going to encourage you to read the freaking logbook more and more. Avoid getting stuck in the ice. So whenever you, yeah, whenever he rears back like that. I think it's good. Or it's just a smash. Hang on, let me pull off the setting. Uh, yeah, whenever you see him rear back like that, you're gonna want to dodge to the side. Supposedly, a uh, boost ball is a great way to dodge it. I disagree. Face is the my bad. Ditch the yeah, listen, ditch the thermals. Face, 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 face. But yeah, he 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 does that roly poly move every time he finishes. As long as that face on core is exposed. Uh, there's too much radiation to get the thermal visor. Here he comes. You can boost ball out of the way of that if you need to. Don't require me slowly morphing and then move. Then you morph ahead of time. Shoot down his little pebble with that. So I wouldn't recommend wasting a super pebble. I was thinking to aim for pebbles, I was thinking to aim for pebbles. Incoming. On a list of things you were expecting to kill today was a giant pile of rocks, one of them. If you were expecting that, you're doing better than I was. Hey, you might want to stay out of the angry rock's way. Yeah, 
don't think he appreciates that. Exactly. If you take your thermos off, you might find things a little bit. Bit of a terrain hazard. Is it like a or something? Uh, sort of. Phase on snowstorm? I don't know. It would also be a lot harder if you know you're bad. Yeah. I spent a lot of time staring at his uh, roly poly form there.
who keeps launching those rocks at you that when you did burn out your uh, thermals. You know this, but they are not Sahimi missiles. Congratulations, you killed a rock. I'm pretty sure there's only one combat vehicle out there in reality with a rock in its skill count. I believe the phrase you're looking for is island. It's a very big rock. Poiter ball. Right click to cling to the mag rails. I see. Uh, that they are. Wait, there's multiple. Hmm? There are multiple mag rails. Guess I wonder if there's something hidden, you know? This doesn't actually do anything, does it? Um, what my it takes, takes you over there. Is this what I was supposed to do, or what I? Oh, I guess this is forward. I'm not missing More anything, am I? Uh, not in this room. Okay. There's one sp thing in the in an adjoining chamber, but you can't access it. Oh. Not without the grapple beam. Almost didn't pick those missiles. <laughs> That's something. He doesn't like you. That will take you down to Magmore Caverns. Ooh, the place with the best music. And you can't go any further that way anyway because uh, you need an ice beam for that. Uh, of course I do. I would die. Oh, it's been an hour already. <laughs> Having fun. Maybe. Of course, would this be a bad time to bad time to tell you that there's not a whole lot you can do from this direction of Magmore Cavern. Is there a safe point anyway? Uh, yeah, the other direction you just came from. I need to go back to the elevator? No, just go back to the elevator room. Yes, this is probably a good stopping point. Perhaps. So, yeah, I hope you'll have fun, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye! <laughs>